Oh yeah, so this game is an early access game. So, you know, if there's if we see a bug or anything, we have to be mindful that the development team is still working on that. And I love that, you know, they are very, you know, direct on that, but also want to make sure that they get as much feedback as possible. So, heck yeah. Super Dungeon Maker, let's go! Oh, look at the little chicken! That's us. <gasps> oh my god. Like, look at how glorious we are. Like, look at us. I, I, I love us. Like, look at that, like, glorious, like, vibe that we gave in. See, a little pollo. Exactly, exactly. So. <laughs> exactly. Actually, does it accept control? Let me actually check that. Again, it being an early access game, I'm not sure, but I do always prefer using my controller. As I'm used to playing mostly console games. Okay, yeah, no, it does it. Okay, fair enough. Worth, worth checking. Especially my mic. You might hear my, my keyboard, so sorry about that. <gasps> Whoa. <laughs> I didn't realize it was a scary game as well. It might still be a bit too loud, so let me change that. Okay. Actually, there's probably a setting here. Aha. So... I do like the music. Okay, much better. Oh, I thank you, Jasmine, for the lurk. I hope you have a wonderful lurk. And thank you, thank you, thank you for stopping by and again for the subscription. I really appreciate that. Okay. If it's too quiet... Then it might be too quiet. There. I think that might be good. Let me know. Ooh. So we play as this adorable chicken. And... Oh, we can cut the grass. But I, I'm not sure how do we interact with that. Uh, that's an enemy. Huh, I'm not sure. Ah, I thank you, Abril, for the lurk. Thank you, thank you. I gotta go back to work. Uh, good luck with work, um, Abril. Yeah, yeah. I, I hope I hope all all, all is good work wise. Oh, I can move these. Oh, and I can throw them. Let's throw it. Heck yeah! Did it actually hit him? So yeah, no. It, any way that you want to hang out here, it's, it's more it's more than welcomed. But yeah, how's everyone's Monday been so far? Anything exciting happening so far? Oh, did you do anything fun for the weekend? Or not really? Exactly, and as Cap says, sending all the productivity vibes. And all the good vibes. I think I even have a good vibes. All the good vibes. Oh, uh, oops. You, yeah, I should have put to someone, <laughs> not just good vibes. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah, so uh, Cap says, I hung out with Amelia. Ah, uh, yeah, I saw that, at least, like, I know that's usually what, you know, you get to do on your weekends. Um, uh, which is so great, and it was really cute, the picture that you sh that, that you shared of um, Gideon being, like, very cuddly with you. Um... <laughs> And I am so busy working on things. Ooh, what what were you working on, Soul? If you want to share, if if not, that's fine. I, I I totally get it. Oh yeah, that's right. It was fun. She was getting over a cold, so we kept it fairly low key. Yeah, that's right. And yeah, I hope she's feeling better, Cap. Um, yeah, because colds are just not fun. Like, I mean, yeah, just in general, getting sick is not fun. Oops. That's how you fall, apparently. Um. Ooh, am I gonna find something here? Oh, hi, Cap. <laughs> oh, 
and then Cap says, oh yeah, it was on the way out by the end of the week. And I, that's great to hear. That, that, that makes me happy. Yeah, because again, like... I know even for me, like, I was having my nose a bit runny. Um, and I feel like that usually happens, like, after I, like, travel for a while. Um, but yeah, I mean, of course, right now I'm okay. And yeah, and I took, like, COVID tests and all of that, so... <gasps> the head pad's not working. Hey, JC, welcome! How's it going? Welcome, welcome! Uh, why did not... Why did not... Why did not... Why didn't that work? Let me try again. Head pads. Oh, it's on cooldown. <laughs> It's funny, like, I feel like I put everything on cold then because I'm like, one one day, chat's gonna get, you know, all, <laughs> all excited and it's gonna spam <laughs> all the redemptions. <laughs> but that hasn't happened yet, but I think I might have overdone it. <laughs> so I don't need to wait, um, which that's, that's a silly thing of me. But here, I'll, I'll, I'll redeem it again um, uh, for you, JC. But yeah, I hope everything is doing well, or else... You know, I hope we make it better here for you, JC. Okay, here we go. Fire! Fire! <laughs> I will say that one of the things I added is that I added some random Kirby sounds into all my alerts because I absolutely love Kirby. Like, Kirby. I feel like Kirby and Axolotls are like siblings, you know? Like, they have a similar energy and I and I love that. I've been playing the game with, with my partner um, and it's really great. So, that's that. <laughs> JC, too many head pads. Exactly, too many head pads. Well, I don't think you can have enough head pads, you know? And it could be like cat head pads or zombie head pads like the, the Motale used. Um, any any head pads are, are more than accepted. Um, oh, and yeah, Cap says, when does the building part come into play? I do wonder that. I, I do wonder if this is like a tutorial and then you get to build something. You know, just so that you kind of know how some dungeons can be done and then we actually build. I'm not sure. And again, this is early access. So I, I, I don't know how far we'll get into the building today. Um, <laughs> cooldown is 90 minutes. No, 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 90 seconds. <laughs> if, it's, if it's 90 something, it would be seconds. <laughs> not minutes. <laughs> I'm not that mean. <laughs> um... <laughs> Oh. Oh. Oh, there you go. Wait, how do I know... What? How do I know which one to move? Oh, like that? Oh, I think just some of them could be moved and some couldn't. Soul said, usually on Mondays, I try to get set up for the week. Such as checking team discords and what's going on. Update my Excel sheets for IGC and check Trello and DL the games and then I try to make sure they run. Oh, that's awesome! So honestly, I should do something like that, like have a dedicated day for that. Because I feel like I do a little bit each day and there are some days that I do more than others. And for me, it's more that like I have multiple to-do lists that I check on a regular basis. But I, I, I really like your idea, so of like having a dedicated day to make sure you didn't miss anything. I might actually take take that advice. I, I love that for you. Um, how how well how much has that worked for you so far, Soul? If you want to share, but I, I love that. Ah, uh, Cap says my brother got a new Kirby game for a million her birthday. I I love that. I I love that so much. Yeah, and again because it it has this like co op functionality, it just works so great. Like, ouch. No. Like, so, so, so great. Like, I play that with my partner and it's just, like, a fun game to play. That's not, like, extremely difficult, but you also kind of just, like... I mean, like, you still, you know, need to, like, figure out when to attack creatures and whatnot. But, like, overall, it's pretty chill. And it, it's just such a good co-op game. Definitely recommend. Oh, I saw. I try. So far, it works. So I'm, I'm, I'm so glad that it, that it's working though for you. So that, that that's really great to hear. Um, also, to your earlier comment, Gideon has been a massive sook ever since I came home today. Oh, <laughs> oh, we love Gideon. Actually, let me wait. Let me check something because oh, 
actually a cup. What do you mean by souk? Like S U U K. Timmy? Lol, right, Spanish. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Lol, right, Spanish is, is, is the right answer. <laughs> Ooh, we have a shield now. I'm definitely getting that shield. Heck yeah. Oh, Sook is like being a little uh, whiner. <laughs> These Canadians. <laughs> we... <laughs> exactly. <laughs> These Canadians. Incorrigible. Exactly. <laughs> no. All good, Cap. We, we, we know we're joking us, you know. Ale and I are fellow, fellow Mexicans. <laughs> oh, interesting. I, uh, okay, crybaby. Okay, okay. <laughs> um... Oh, yeah, I know, like, definitely, for example, after the two weeks that I was gone uh, in Mexico, like, Charles, the way Charles, like, shows that he missed me is, like, being, like, extremely cuddly, and yeah, sometimes, like, if I'm just, like, sitting down, like, working, he would, like, go to me and be like, eh, like, can I vibe with you? And I'm like, of course, Charles, and then he just, like, stays on my, la on my lap. <laughs> so that's Charles' reaction when whenever I, 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 I go away. Um. Oh, Cap, see? Uh, Cap says, huh, so I'm just now realizing that Sook is a specific Atlantic Canadian slang. See, so Ale is right. These Canadians. <laughs> just kidding. No, to be honest, I feel like this is like a fun story that I have to, to, to share on that. So I was in this like summer camp a while ago. And in the summer camp, there were people from all over the world, right? Um, and I mean, we all had to speak in English, right? But there was this person uh, who was from... Oh my god, I have my shield. How do I use my shield? Where, there are all these people... No, 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 not all of these people, but... There was this person who w was originally from Spain, right? And I'm like, oh, I can talk to you in Spanish, no problem. But no, we there were like so many different... I didn't realize that so many of the words I use in Spanish are like Mexican slang. That even just sometimes communicating her stuff, she was like, I have no idea what you're saying. And there were some times that like, even though we both know Spanish, like, it would be much easier to talk to each other in English. <laughs> because, like, the great example that I have is that, you know, this was when I was younger. So there was this, like, hangout at a pool. Um, in Spanish, at le in Mexico, at least, we say alberca. But at least in Spain, they say piscina. So I kept telling her, like, oh, let's meet at the alberca later today. And she was like, what's this place? And I was like, trying to describe it <laughs> in Spanish. And then she still was very confused. So I'm like, okay, we're meeting at the pool. And then she's like, oh, piscina. And I'm like, oh my god, why is this so hard? <laughs> so all of this to say that I feel like we don't really realize, at least... For some people, and definitely my case as well, like you have that, there's just some words that like are very local to the place you're from. Um, so that's that. Ah, and Sol replied to Ale. Yeah, that. Heck yeah, for your organization, Sol. I'm definitely gonna do some some hype for that. Heck yeah. All the hype. All the hype for Sol's organization. <laughs> I do love that. No, really, I do love that for you, Sol. Um, Cap says, listen, you show me Spanish, I show you Atlantic Canadian slang. Heck yeah, I I, I love that energy, Cap. <laughs> and and I'm I laughing at my story. Yeah, no, I, I really struggle communicating with her. With this, like, friend in, in the summer camp. And hence, I'm like, okay, no more Spanish to you, I guess. Um... Ooh. Something's gonna need to happen. Ah, I see it. Heck yeah. Oh. Wait, how do... Oh, shift. Oh, nice! Now I can dodge. I love that. But yeah, I don't know if any of you have has had a similar experience with... 
thinking that you know the same language as someone else, but if they're from a different area or a different country, some words can be so different. Oh, this is what... Okay, I think I know what's going to happen. This... This... Um, roll action, I bet it's going to help me skip these... These gaps. Heck yeah! Oh, I love that for us. Well, I'm really liking this game. I mean, I know we haven't gotten to the... Uh, dungeon creation part that I know Cap is very excited about. I and mean, probably many of you are as well, but... Yeah, and then what Alice said that Spanish is all different country from country to country, right? Yeah, and I'd say especially if it's somewhere like Spain, I feel like at least... I mean, even within Latin America, don't get me wrong, it can be very different. But for Spain, there were just some words that were like so different. Like, I can't even remember now, but like... The accent obviously is different, but then even just some words was like, I, I can't believe we're saying the same thing. I've had experiences in Spain where I'm like, okay, I need in real life subtitles. <laughs> oh my god, in real life subtitles would just be a, a good life hack if we could only do that. Um, <laughs> uh, because yes, I can, yes, <laughs> that's a good, that's a fun I like how you're describing that, Ale. Ah, uh, yes, I got a little squishy comb uh, on the chicken's head, right? I know, it's like so cute. So, so stylish. I, I love how stylish our character is. I absolutely love that about us. I, I still don't know what to do with these mushrooms, though. So, they might just be decoration to be age. Oh, there's a heart there. Oh, no. Oh, okay. No, no, no. We had to fall there. <gasps> it's a secret spot. No, never mind. Also very bouncy, right? Yeah. I, I just like, like the, the vibe the, the chicken gives. I do love that. Oh, my God. I didn't mean to do that. Well, I can just grab a heart. Oh, my God. Of course. Of course. Oof. Oh, come on. Um, sure, let's get it. Ooh, a key. Okay, okay. I think we had to get it, so. That's like France French speakers look at us in New Brunswick. Oh, yeah, one of the two... Officially bilingual provinces and shiver with disgust. Oh, that's actually a really good point. I, I never really made that connection that probably the French that you speak in Canada is very different than the one in France. Oh, we're back from the we're back at the beginning. Right? But now Ooh, now we might be able to get to areas that we couldn't get to before. But yeah, exactly, Cap. I, I completely agree with you on that. Aha, like here. Hi, this game looks so cute, right? And it's actually made by the same people that are releasing a new Wizarding World game. Um, sometime next year. Called Spells and... Oh my god, I can't remember. I'm so bad with names. But I've seen actually other streamers uh, showcase this game. Spells and Secrets, which is actually currently on Kickstarter. And I actually had the option of potentially showcasing it, but I, I, I kind of wanted to focus on other games. And considering that that's like a very, very, very like early and a very, very early access stage, like this is like their alpha demo. And I've seen some people, you know, like their computers not being strong enough, considering that there aren't that many um, optimization in the demo. I'm like, oh yeah, my, my computer won't be able to, to deal with it. But I've actually heard really great things. Like, I, <laughs> I saw one of a uh, fellow Cosmic Hearts friend uh, streaming this uh, earlier today, actually, like really early today. And I'm like, yep, I am backing this game. <laughs> and it's by the same uh, people that this game is. Well, actually, I'm not sure if the same developers, but at least the same publishers. Oh, no, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. 
yeah, same people. Yeah, Roca play. Uh, working currently on Spells and Secret, and then their most recent game that I guess they're also working on, as this is still early access. Super Dungeon Maker. So yeah, definitely, like, kudos to them. Hi, Maple! How's it going, Maple? It's so great having you here. And it's so exciting that actually, uh, knowing that your birthday was uh, relatively recent, we both have birthdays very close from each other. So I'm definitely going to do a hype birthday for both of us. Heck yeah! I <laughs> uh, welcome, Maple. I hope you're having a good day. Or else, we'll try to make it better here. Oh, I'm pumped for ha Haunted Chocolatier. Oh, what's that cap? Am I missing something? I feel like... I I'm so sorry, Cap. I feel like I've, I've been missing stuff, and I'm so sorry. <laughs> I apologize. <laughs> I'm not sure if I'm if, if I miss something. Ah, Ian Maple to Cap. Hello, fellow Canadian. OMG, I wanted... I want to visit New Brunswick one day to hear the Canadian French dialect. Yeah, and again, that's exactly what we're talking about, and I didn't realize that's probably very different. I feel like that'd be really cool to... to I guess to see how much we will be able to tell the differences, so... Oh no, this is gonna be an interesting puzzle, won't it? Well, I was able to do that. Um, but maybe that's not what I wanted. Because I don't think our dash is that powerful enough. Let's see. Nope. Oh no! Oh wait, can we carry this rock? Or this mushroom? Or maybe if we walk and dash at the same time? <gasps> Heck yeah! Oh, and thank you, thank you Ale for the game info command. Heck yeah, yeah, you can definitely check it out yourselves! Um... Yeah, there's a link to the game and currently it's 20% off, so... Hey! If you're liking this game, definitely check it out! Oh, how the chocolatier is from the person who made Stardew Valley. Don't worry, that comment was super random. Oh, no, 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 it's not super random. I mean, it's fair for you to assume that, like, I, I do know about this game as... Actually, fun fact, like... I was really into Stardew Valley, but I, I, I just realized that I've never actually, like, streamed that, you know, here. Because I would... I played the heck out of Stardew Valley, and then, I'm, and then I played so much that I'm like, okay, let me find a new game, and then found Animal Crossing, and then... And then, here we are. <laughs> No, and then, you know, streamed Animal Crossing and, you know, so much happened because of Animal Crossing. But what made me get into Animal Crossing was Stardew Valley. So I, I've been always a huge fan of, of, of um, Stardew Valley. Oh, wait. Yeah, is that like also like the uh, uh, Wizarding World? Cap, is, is, is that the game? I didn't, I didn't remember. Ah, yeah. Oh, no, 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 wait. Is it? I don't know, I think it is, right? It, it's like pretty much Star of the Valley, but Wizarding World. Aha, or at least that there's, there's like magic involved. Yeah, that's awesome. Ooh. Oh, okay. Oh, it's not a Wizarding... Okay, got it. It's not a Wizarding World, but there's magic in it. Okay, got it. Oh, do you know when will it uh, be released, Cap? Have, have they talked about it? But yeah, I guess going back to, to the game, uh, for those that kind of joined more recently. So we're playing a game in which you play as a very fashionable chicken, as you can see. With with its its, its, its glorifying redness. <laughs> um, and then later in game, we'll also be able to create our own dungeons. As the name of this game is Super Dungeon Maker. So we haven't gotten to that part yet. But it'll be exciting to see. There you go. Nice. Oh, okay. We don't know much about it yet. I don't think there's been any talk about this at all. Oh, okay. Concerned Dave is, is being pr pretty secretively about it. Okay, yeah. And I'm not surprised, like, considering that it's them. I feel like they they just are more secretive until they 
you feel comfortable like giving more information or like a lot of information at once so yeah that makes sense um that they that they don't have much to share at the moment um oops okay who oh, are, are you also uh, following that ale uh that that game yeah, I should be better at actually following indie games, like, on my own. Like, the, I mean, the way I do it mostly is through Twitter, actually. And then, obviously, through the indie game collective. And especially, I've been trying, for example, like, this game. Or I've, I've noticed, and I know we talked about this in the past, but for those who haven't heard, like, many of the games I like, either they are published by the same people or they're by the same developer, which makes sense, right? Like, there's they have similar styles, so it makes sense that, like, they have a connection so once i find a publisher or once i find like a couple of games that i really like by a specific publisher then i would like follow that publisher on steam or on twitter or things like that also again like i don't know what's up with these mushrooms ah yeah nale yeah heck yes big fan of star the belly and concert date yeah no and especially especially like really great games that have just been so powerful for so many years like stardew valley like heck yeah <laughs> ale ale with the popcorn i think i need to fall oh yes now i'm now i'm on this side <gasps> we did it team <laughs> Oh, wait, I, I I can use... Let me try if it works. Is it working? We did it, team! Heck yeah! There you go. That's that. <laughs> oh, I'm so, hopefully that wasn't too loud, but I, I think I should have changed. Oh. Wait, is it back to normal now? I've been trying to use... um. Keybinds for voice mod so that I can twitch easily. So, I should have done the sword one. We did it, team! We succeeded at the dungeon! We were big arrows on the ground. Oh, there were big arrows on the ground! <laughs> oh, that's awesome! That's that, Leo. I'm glad! <laughs> oh, yeah, I love this area! It's like so... I don't know, I just... I love it! <laughs> it's so, like... So bright and full of green and full of other adorable little birds. Hey, listen, would you join us in our sandbox, please? Oh, we want to learn how to build custom dungeons. This is what Cap was asking about. Let's do it. Oh, I see there were big arrows in the ground just in case you didn't know where to go. Oh, I didn't notice that. I love that. Oh, are those parakeets? I think you're right, Cap. Welcome to the Budgie Brigade's base. At least we hope you have a base. We are no builder masters like you. Will you help us finish it? Oh, heck yeah. Let's help the parakeets. Switch to build mode with P. Ooh, we can paint some floor. Oh, fancy. Actually, let me move the... um. Oh. Uh, give me a second. Uh, the camera. So you can see the settings. Uh, Yeah, there's like so many settings. Um, yeah, I'm gonna put it here. I, I, I think this one's fine if I leave it there. Just so you can see the settings. Oh, uh, but then... Actually, maybe I'm gonna switch here. And then... This over here. Perfect. Perfect. Okay, so... Uh... So much going on. Oh, budgies and parakeets are the same birds. Oh, okay. So I thought that was just a word that wasn't. I didn't know what it was, but no, it's a type of bird. Uh. Uh -huh, I'm I'm just a budgie. I thought like budgie meant like something else. I didn't realize it meant it was referencing a bird. Yeah, I've never heard of that word before. Ah, and then Aliperiquitos Australianos. Oh, I wonder if budgies... Is budgies like a way to say it, like... 
in another language, like in a specific country. That's really what I meant. Cap. Okay. <gasps> oh, no, 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 no. Uh, oh my god, there's like so much going on in this thing. Okay, so this is for adding stuff. Uh, undo. Um, oh, this is for the color. Maybe? Oh, no, 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 no. <gasps> Hi! Pat, thank you so much for the raid! Hi, everyone! Welcome, welcome! Going everyone, yes, welcome, welcome, Raiders. Um, what, what were you uh, doing, Kat? And yeah, for those who don't know, Kat is not only a wonderful streamer, but she is one of my fellow indie game collective partners. Um, so me, Alex, I email Exinator, and I kind of got together through the indie game collective and. We've been kind of getting to know each other more as we were pretty much all paired up, us three, considering that we have a similar vibe within our Twitch communities and just in general we showcase similar games. So pretty much we're very similar in what we do and our content. So if you like my content, you will also like Kat's content. And actually I was able to meet Kat in person uh, through PAX East. So that was also very exciting. <laughs> I feel like, I don't know, it's always exciting when, like, I meet a friend in per- Like, when I meet an online friend in person because it's like, ah, oh, like, now, now I now I know, like, now I've seen you. <laughs> so, that's, that's a fun fact, I guess, about Kat and I. Uh, but how are you doing, Kat? And I guess for those who don't know, my name is Sophia. Or you can call me Fierce, as my username is Fierce Axolotl. I am an aggressively kind, wholesome, charity-focused streamer and indie game enthusiast. I mostly play indie games, such as today we're playing a really adorable game called Super Dungeon Maker. And I will actually really briefly show you my tra channel trailer, as I feel like I have not done that in a while. So yeah, I'll catch up with the uh, chat, Pat, and actually before I go to the trailer, I know whenever I'm done streaming, I'm like super tired. So Kat, if you have to like raid and lurk, like I totally get it. No, no worries. No, no need to apologize. You know, definitely take care of yourself. But for those that stay after the trailer, we'll, we'll talk soon. Me, my name is Sofia. I tend to stream indie games and Nintendo games. When you arrived. Oh, you're not hog. Then it goes here and then it breaks. <laughs> <laughs> oh sh heck I saw that Kat mentioned the Discord hat, and heck yeah, <laughs> this is the Discord hat that Kat was mentioning in chat. So one of the things that also happened, at, well, at PAX East, there's like so many different like booths of so many different companies, <laughs> publishers. Oh, I thank you for the hype, Pale. <laughs> uh, for the hype, yeah, exactly, that, that, exactly. And I absolutely love this hat, it's like so cute and adorable. And I really like these, the hats with this design, you know, that like they cover you like completely throughout, you know, your whole face. And it's kind of like perfect for, you know, if you go for a walk and I'm, I'm actually going to be wearing this when, whenever we play bug snacks, because it has that same energy as bug snacks with all the little bugs. And I don't know, I just love the hat. And yes, as um, Kat mentioned in chat, we were one of the lucky ones who got one of the last hats at the convention, so... You know, all the cool kids wear this hat, so. <laughs> but yeah, no, it was so great seeing you, Kat. And I did see your message that, yeah, yeah, yeah. If you if you want to go ahead and make some dinner, uh, no worries, um, Kat. Feel free to do so. Oh, uh, and yeah, it definitely reminds... Yeah, it definitely gives Flick vibes as well. Um, heck yeah. <laughs> yeah, exactly. 
exactly right we got the last two like literally i think like literally the last two <laughs> I, 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 I'm imagining your enthusiasm with, with, yes, we got the last two. I'll be back. Yeah, yeah, no, no worries. But yeah, definitely um, have a good dinner. And we'll see you soon then. But yeah, thank you again so much for the raid. And again, welcome everyone to the Axolotl fam. So happy to have you here. Oh, let me see if I didn't miss anything. No, I think we're all good. Oh, and then you were playing Dungeons of... Dreadrock. Oh, I'm actually not sure what that game is about. I'll need to check it out later in your channel. Ah, oh, and then Indy said, Sophia is the sweetie, sweetest, but you know what I like to say about that. No, you. Ah, <laughs> uh, but yeah, thank you. Thank you, uh, Cat4, for, for the lurk. Aw. <laughs> but yeah, for those that are still hanging out, we'll continue with the game. And we are just starting the dungeon making aspect of the game. So we're kind of like still exploring how this works. So I was told something about changing the color of the floor. But. Oh. Oh, you can also add floors. That's what this is about. Oh, and then you can change it so that it's... Oh, like the theme. You can make it like... Oh, and even the music changes depending on the theme. Oh, that's awesome. It was cute. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I feel like I'm so bad that like when someone lurks, I keep talking to them. But no, 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 no. <laughs> Go 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 to your go take your lurk, uh, Kat, and I'll I'll, re I'll reread your messages when once you're back. <laughs> uh. Actually, I think I like yeah. I, I'm kind of you know in spirit of of the Discord hat and me kind of like liking the green energy. We'll we'll keep this dungeon green. And again, I probably won't make a dungeon right now with all of you, but I am curious as to how this works. Oh, uh, oops. I forget that I have some... <laughs> I forget that I have some specific keys. I might need to change them <laughs> for for mix it up. Ay, burritos! Enjoy, enjoy, um, cat. Enjoy making them. Oh, a chest. Perfect. Oh, let's at least try to finish making this uh, until we get to the end of the game. Let's do that. So... Oh, F! Oh, no. Oops. Whoa. Oh, my God. <laughs> Uh oh no, did it glitch? Whoa. <laughs> um I didn't mean to do that. And I can't undo it somehow. Uh sure, I'll just keep it like that. As I think the un undo kinda glitched a little bit. Oh, but this is kind of what we want, right? Because now we can go through there. Yeah, is the, is the voice back to normal? It should be. Yeah, it should be. Yeah, I know. The, the voice might have um glitch a little bit. But that, that, that's my end. <laughs> Ale, ooh, burritos. And bots, but molly burritos. I think molly burritos would be pretty, pretty great. <laughs> exactly. Good bot, right? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Oh, okay. Mm. 
Whoa, this is giant. Oh my god, like imagine how creative you can be with these. I love that. And then as I mentioned before, that you can add different floors and whatever. I love that. I actually probably won't spend that much building. I kind of want to check out more of the game itself first. Of what the game has to offer. If not, you know, we can definitely make our own. But heck yeah, this looks like really well. And especially it being early access. Oh, and then you can see that each of them are kind of surrounded by something. You might be able to move them around. So much. Like... Oh, look like that. Oh, and then this is erased. I get it. Oh, and then what F? Oh. Okay. So that's a glimpse at all of how powerful this editor is. Oh, and you can also change how bright it is. Wow. I love it. Yeah, and again, later we might actually go and, and check, check more of it ourselves. But I do kind of want to see more what the game has to offer on its own without building stuff. <laughs> and I love that they're playing at an actual sandbox. That's really adorable. I heard the legend once, if you find seven special eggs, you can summon Hen Long. He is a legendary chicken dragon. Oh my god, a chicken dragon? I think we need to find a chicken dragon. I think that's our goal. <laughs> Have you met the evil twin? <laughs> oh no. Excuse me. Ooh. Did you know? You can control the music volume in the pause menu. We figured that out. Have playground, dungeon building. Oh, so this is where we actually create them. Like the other was more of a tutorial, and this is actually us creating it. Oh, that's actually really nice. I mean, you have that sandbox area, but then you actually have like an area to to make them yourself. I I do really love that. Uh, then you have. Dungeon Exped Expedia. Oh my god, is this like visiting other dungeons? Ooh. Creepy grass, let's try this. <laughs> oh my god. Hey, I love it. Oh, uh, and you can see like all the different projects and whatever. Oh, and some people even like, oh my god, look, a little fox. Oh, you can't really see it that well. Look at the fox. Oh, it's so cute. Oh, I see. And then it's like hot dungeons, top dungeons, new dungeons. Oh, and then dungeons search. Oh my god. We do want to appreciate the dungeon ponds. Hi, Tanuki, thank you so much for the Tanuki subscription and hi! Subscribed. Thank you for donating to charity. Hi, how are you doing, Tanuki? I hope you're doing well. Or else, I hope we make it better here. But not really, Tanuki, I hope you you and the little cub. <laughs> and Panda, I hope Panda. you are doing great. Yes, hi, hi, Tanuki. We're playing as a wonderful chicken, actually, right now. Well, right now we're checking dungeons made by other people, as this is a dungeon-making game. But yes, hi. Ooh, Undertale? Oh. Oh, no, wait. That was the exit. Ooh. 
Wait a second. Oh my god, did someone make it so that it's like... Like the same settings as everything as Undertale? Are you kidding me? I actually played that game a little bit a while back. I never actually ended up finishing it. Um, but I know actually a good... I mean, Ale, uh, a wonderful friend of four, ours, um, has been playing this game on stream. So may maybe... Maybe you, Ale, will definitely recognize some of the things here. That's insane. Yeah, there's like some people that like get to some level of creativity that I'm like, what? <laughs> You're a chicken? Yes, we're a chicken, Tanuki. Aw, Tanuki pandas is high as well. Oh, he's getting ready to feed the cub. Oh, yes. And I, I hope you've also had much better nights now, uh, Tanuki. I, I really hope so. Yeah, no, this is incredible. So this specific level we're checking right now is inspired by... Undertale. Oh, and then you can add, like, some sections. Like, within a given area, you can change the ground slightly. Oh, this is gonna be a boss? I'm not sure, but I love that idea that they're that they kind of use Undertale's like setup and just make it here. I love that. Oh, uh, they are getting better, getting into a rhythm. Oh, that's really good to hear, Tanuki. I'm, I'm so glad to hear that. Ooh, a hard the boss. Ooh, the puzzler. We need to check this one out. Okay, we can't swim. But see, for example, I do wonder if there are some normal areas, like, that we can explore things like the ocean. Well, not the ocean, but like, some mechanics that we haven't seen in the actual game. But I guess, you know, that that's a glimpse to what game... To what type of dungeons you can make and you can share them to other people Ooh, this is definitely a game i'm gonna play also like on my off time and i might actually make my own dungeon i put it out there and especially games that give this level of flexibility like the replayability of these are is insane right because if you're more in the creative side of things you can make multiple dungeons or if you're more into the gameplay side of things and you can play all the different dungeons that people make so, like, games like this are so powerful replayability-wise that, heck yeah, I'm, I'm very excited that, that I got to, to not only showcase this game to all of you, but also I'll probably be playing, you know, some more of it uh, later after today's stream. Ah, yeah, and Tanuki says, Cub is pretty easy, so all considering we are lucky. Oh, I know, that's really great to hear, um, Tanuki. Yeah, especially I feel like... I know, I don't know. I feel like I'd just be worried all the time. <laughs> Especially like the very first day. So I'm I'm so glad to hear that everything is 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 so is is going smoothly, um Tanuki. <laughs> the parakeet. I wish I had a full head of gorgeous hair. Like you think. Oh, we're named Fink. I, I didn't I didn't remember that we had a name. Did you know? You can control the colored barriers with a switch. Ooh. There's a hidden switch somewhere. Um, oh, maybe it's hidden somewhere here? Maybe not. I also just love this town. It's like so, so pretty. <gasps> dungeon of Trees. Oh, I'm excited to check the Dungeon of Trees. Oops. Yeah, let's, let, let's go check it out. Okay, yeah, so there's there's more to the game before actually um, doing the dungeon. So yeah, let, let, let's check out more of the game. I uh, being worried is part of being a parent. You, you get used to it. Yeah, no, I feel like... At least for me, I feel like that will be one of the things I will struggle with the most to be age. Um, 
But yeah, I'm, I'm like so, so happy for both of you, Tanuki and Panda. Like, oh, it warms my heart so much. And I know I've said it multiple times, but it really does. <laughs> it really, really does. Um, oops. Oh, I still don't have the the shift mechanic yet. I need to actually get it in, in this dungeon. Oh, so the different mechanics that you get in other dungeons don't... You don't keep them. I mean, I do keep my sword, but that's it. Oh, oops. Oh, that works. Oh, uh, okay. No, nope. oops. There you go. Oh yeah, because I, I I'm just following like these. This specific entrance means that it's some like escalators that that you're going through. Because yeah, so right now we're kind of playing like the already created dungeons as part of the game even though again the big part of the game is playing other people's dungeons but i'm assuming that this kind of is going to make me actually be familiarized with all the mechanics and whatnot and then probably either later today or just offline i'll i'll check out the other options okay So now we can go through here. Oh, and then that I bet that's gonna be the dash that, that we want. Ah, Tanuki says Panda says this looks like Zelda Link to the Past, but as a chicken. <laughs> yeah, no, it definitely gives Zelda vibes. And again, you should tell Panda Tanuki that it also has that um, Mario Maker buy because you can make your own dungeons. It's pretty much making your own dungeons, Zelda. But yeah, definitely. I I I I I, I think you're you're very much right on that. Um, uh, yeah, Panda is very is is correct on that. I. <gasps> There. Oof. <laughs> I was very aggressive, like, kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it. I think there's a section in Link to the Past where you can build your own as well. Wait, which one is Link to the Past? Fun fact, my first Zelda game was Breath of the Wild. <laughs> yeah, and actually, in general, fun fact, I'm, like, relatively new to gaming, like... I mean, I, I would play when I was younger things like Mario Kart. I mean, that's why <laughs> that's why I'm as good as Mario Kart as I am. And many Mario games, but I actually didn't play that many games outside of Mario. Like, Mario specific, right? Until very recently. Um, so, Zelda. Oh, no, Link to the Past. Oh, okay. And I think actually, I think I should be able to play Zelda because I am paying for the, you know, Nintendo Switch Online, maybe. Oh my god. I, like, especially now that I'm paying for the online for for Switch, I should actually, like, check some so many of these, like, classic games so that I actually at least have some exposure to them. Yeah, exactly. It'll be on the Switch S SNES emulator, right? Yeah, so I should actually I should actually at least like check them out for a little bit. Oh yeah, Tanuki, you're on the big screen. Hi! <laughs> or I, I should do something even more silly. I should do something like uh do I have it here? Oh I don't. I'll just Hi <laughs> Now I'm up now now I'm on a giant screen as it's just my face. <laughs> Um. <laughs> hope, hope, hope that didn't scare um the cub. <laughs> uh. Also, actually, Cap, do you know which? If do you know if there's any Zelda game that has 
building your own dungeon because I don't know or anyone else in chat if, if anyone else in chat knows what, what game that is uh, yeah feel free to share The only cell that I played was for NES. <laughs> hey, I mean, if that makes you feel like... I feel like it's better to play older games than very new games. Like, I, I think... I mean, yeah, like, my first Zelda game was Breath of the Wild. <laughs> and I really want to play more Zelda games. But here's the thing, right? Like, I absolutely love Breath of the Wild. And it was actually Breath of the Wild which made me buy the Switch. Um, as I played it over at the friend's house, and I'm like, okay, buying the Switch just to play this game. And then I got into Animal Crossing, and then I got into indie games. So now I feel like I actually don't play that many Nintendo games, because I see how much there is to indie games. And especially, like, if it's, like, a Nintendo game, it's gonna be, like, 60 bucks. So I'm like, oh, you know, I'd much rather, like, support indie developers and play more games with less money. <laughs> So actually, I feel like I have not bought a Zelda game. I mean, I'm gonna buy the, the sequel to Breath of the Wild, but kind of these like remasters of older Zelda games, I haven't really tried. So all of this to say that I should actually check the emulators that already come in on the Switch if you pay for um, the online family pack thing. Oh, and analysis. Link's Awakening is the one I meant. I played the Switch remaster. Oh, I have Link's Awakening is the one with the remaster. Oh my god, I will say that I was really close of getting that remaster because that one looks like so adorable. Like, wait, is, is it the one that I'm thinking of? Let me just double check. But I'm pretty sure it's the one that the art style looks like all like cute. It, it looks like aggressively cute. I just kind of want to like play with like little figurines of the game. I think that's the one you're mentioning. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so I feel like that would be a game I would totally want to play, but but yeah. Ah, oh, yes, yes, no worries, uh, Tanuki. And yeah, if at some point you need to lurk and you forget to say that you have to lurk, that's completely okay as well, Tanuki. But, but yeah, thank you, thank you for the lurk. I, I appreciate you. And Panda and the cub. The three of you. <laughs> um, and the cats, of course. I appreciate all all, all five of you. <laughs> Ooh, I played the OG Game Boy version of Link's Awakening. Oh, that's awesome, Cap. And again, thank you. Thank you for the lurk, Tanuki. Yeah, no, again, I really need to, to play more of these classics. I have to say. Like, even for Mario, the only reason why I played Classics is because I bought that, like, special edition Switch game that came with three Mario games, but... But, yeah. Um, although I will say that, like, I'm definitely a bigger fan of open-world games, so I feel like of all Zelda games, my favorite is, is definitely kind of like Breath of the Wild type. But I do also really like dungeon-y games like this, so... Oh, finally. Oh, this is the, the tool I've been looking for forever. Heck yeah. Now we can get the heart. Oh, this is just like a fire? Fair enough. Now we can switch the other button to then go to that door. over here oh and then we get okay 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 i know what to do well maybe let's actually go up first um okay yeah that's a bit too high oh hey not gonna complain about that wait what happens if i go here oh perfect perfect i love it yeah and i love that like 
if you go to a higher level like there's still some logic depending on where you fall right that like you might be on one side or the other side of a given area that that's that's really cool um, i really like that oh wait we already have the key wasn't there like a key somewhere here oh but we still need to change the switch we had to get both the key and change the switch ah that's what we needed to do ah okay awesome aha uh -huh. ah and then we can do this now we have that sh uh, shift ability Heck yeah, let's go team. We got this. I'm excited. Oof, so many enemies. And I don't have a, I don't have a, a shield. Ah. Oh, this enemy without the shield can be tricky. But we got this though. Ah, heck yeah, we did it, we did it, team! Oh, we almost killed all the enemies. Heck yeah. I am really low on life, though. <laughs> uh, oh, there you go. Well, no, yeah, definitely give Zelda vibes. You know, like, Zelda game vibes. Actually, yeah, for those that played other Zelda games, what would be one of your favorite Zelda games? And, and, and again, for me, it's kind of Breath of the Wild, but I feel like I should really check out more games before I really say if that's my favorite game or not. My favorite Zelda game. Um, but yeah, I'd be curious. If you want to share. Uh, I just figured to, to ask because we were chatting about that. I need another key. Oh, no, 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 no. Hmm. Maybe... Over here? Okay, so now I can go through here. Oh, uh, but I don't think that's... Let me turn back to red. Because maybe we go... Oh, wait. Is there a way to see a map? Oh, I don't think so. I do wonder if they're going to add, like, a map option. I mean, or maybe that's part of the dungeon that you need to kind of remember things. Oops. I clicked the wrong button. Oh, my God. No. My first Zelda game was Breath of the Wild 2. I didn't know that, Dale. Hey! <laughs> welcome, welcome to the clan, then. <laughs> I actually didn't didn't remember that, Dale. <laughs> Unless you come playing as Link on Smash Bros. 64. Oh my god, I love that. Oh, and what... Actually, yeah, what, what made you, Ale, if you want to share, play Zelda much later? I know for me, I feel like in general, like even though like my family was okay with me playing video games, I felt like my brain still subconsciously was like, oh, some games aren't for me because I'm a girl, which is so weird, right? Like considering that I aspired like, like many of the things I like academic wise were very much not like the stereotypical thing like a girl would do but i still like went for it um because yeah society is messed up with with those stereotypes but it's kind of crazy I, like things like pokemon for example i remember that you know with these guy friends that i would play mario kart with i always saw pokemon as a very guy oriented game so i never really picked it up <laughs> and that's one of the games that, like, I, I honestly wish I played it more because it, nowadays it's such a nostalgia game that, like, I feel like I'm not as into it yet. Um, so, so yeah. Oh, welcome, uh, Belgian scene. 
um, or Helgesine. Let me know how if let me know how you would want to be called if I'm mispronouncing your name. I'll definitely do my best to to pronounce it the way you prefer me to do so. Oh, there is no map yet, but the devs have it down as a potential option. Oh, thank you for sharing that, and welcome, welcome. Happy to have you here. Yeah, and, and I, 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 I was. Oh, Fred. <laughs> Fred is fine. Oh, welcome, welcome, Fred. Yeah, and again, I, I'm just bad with pronouncing things. So, um, so I mean, again, if you want me to pronounce it in a specific way, like I just need to know the pronunciation. I guess maybe I should say like I'm bad. I can be bad at knowing how to correctly pronounce something, but to actually pronounce it, I will really do my my effort. Um, so no worries on that. But yeah, I'll call you Fred then. Welcome, welcome, Fred. Um, oh, how's it going? Ooh, there's new updates every week? Oh my god, that's awesome! So yeah, I'm very new to the game. This is the first time I'm playing it, as I got the key for the game just a few days ago. I think yesterday or the day before, but nowadays, like, my weekends just... It's like one entity that I can't remember when exactly, but yeah, very recently. Oh, thank you for that info, Fred. I love that. And especially, I kind of want to get used to, like... The way some of the games... I mean, I, I really appreciate that, like, even though it's like a dungeon-making game, they still have, like, a preset dungeon for you to explore because i know for me that's how i'm gonna get inspiration if i ever want to actually make a dungeon myself so heck yeah oh yeah this is this is the thing wait what oh i'm, I'm remembering now what what i need to do oh and uh, alice said <laughs> Which I didn't regarding playing as Ling because I'm a Kirby main. Heck yeah, Ale, I'm also a, a Kirby main. Heck yeah, hype, hype. <laughs> hype for Kirby. <laughs> I never got around it. I don't know why. I know Becca loved them. Yeah, right? And I feel like it's just one of those weird things that I, I don't know why I didn't play that many games growing up. Even though my p family w was okay with me playing games. But hey, now we're here. <laughs> Now I'm streaming games as my hobby, so all good. I cap you also main Kirby. Are you are you serious? I love that. I love that for us. Kirby mains in chat. Heck yeah. Oh my god, I can't find this key that I'm missing. Exactly, Kirby Mains Unite, right? Oh, I made Kirby for a few of the Smash games. I feel like on th this this is really great to hear because I feel like so many people are like, oh, Kirby's such a bad character. No, it isn't. It's such a great character for Smash. It's so great that Kirby is the only survivor in Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. Like, Kirby is epic. That That's what we all should have learned in that game. That Kirby is e epic and should be respected. <laughs> oh, I bet this is where I need to go. Over here. Aha, okay, found it. Found it. Found the team. Oh, I guess I don't need to kill it. Oh, no, I do need to kill it. Oh no! Oh, whoa, 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 whoa! Oh my god, I'm almost dying. Right? Kirby is the best! Heck yeah, Ale! Ah, and Soul, Soul with the adorable Kirby emo. Thank you, thank you, Soul, for that, for that intervention. <laughs> I love that. Oh, I know where we are. Okay. But we needed the dash for this. Okay. Oh my god, I need to be really careful. <laughs> I feel like I'm gonna die. <laughs> right, let's try to find some hearts. Shift. Okay. I keep clicking the wrong button. Ah, welcome back, cat. Welcome, welcome. 
How how was dinner? How was your burrito? I, I hope I hope it was great. Okay. Oh my god, I need to go through that area in which I almost always lose a life. So let's be patient. Oh my god, I'm so nervous. <laughs> I'm so nervous. <laughs> oh my god, okay. Okay. Oh, and it's gonna be a boss, won't it? I know! No, 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 no! Ay, 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 ay! What in the world? <gasps> Oh no, I get it. Maybe. Oh my god, I feel like we're not gonna make a team. But I'm never gonna give up. Oh no! <laughs> I spoke too soon. Okay, we're gonna wait wait wait. Do I still Do I have to reset do I have to restart a lot? Or not really? Because it might it might be an easy fix. I, I might just be able to go immediately to the wall, so we might be good. Ah, I can't say so good. Burritos are top tier. Heck yeah. Ah, this is great, says all. Go little pollo. Well, we might have not made it our first try, but this next try, I think we got this team. Yeah. Yeah, we definitely got this. Oh. Oh, there you go. Oh, that was much easier than I realized. It's funny because I thought we had to completely redo the dungeon, but it was much uh, more lenient with that. So that that's good news. Oh, and we made it. Oh my God, that was so close to being done with the dungeon. We did it. We completed the mission with no problem. <laughs> Just adding some dramatic voice mod um, here and there. Oh, I love that! That was great. Actually, what time is it? Oh, okay, we're, we, we have good um, enough time. Oh, we haven't actually checked all the villagers. Oh, is this another dungeon? Let's check the villagers first. Um, There are holes in the dungeon which can lead to floors below. Heck yeah! Let me go in. Nope. Oh, there's another parakeet. <laughs> we used to have a pillory here for fun. <laughs> oh, the little birdies. Did you know our ancestors could fly by simply flapping their wings? Oh, you can't fly? I'm so sorry. Ooh, and then we're gonna find bombs eventually. Oh, there's this, like, statue over here. It's just kind of biting, though. Let it be. Yeah, we can't really interact with it. Oh, look at this fancy eagle. Did you know you can hold the attack button to unleash a spin attack? Oh. Oh, I love that. Oh, that's really useful. Thank you. Thank you, um, eagle friend. Oh, let's see. Let's check this out. Is this a new area? Oh, it is. Oh, and there's like a fly. <laughs> I love that I'm using like my super powerful attack on these flies. If they're pretty innocent. But you never know. You never know. Some bugs can be pretty dangerous. Oh, uh, there's these blob things. Ah! Excuse me! Whoa! Ouch. Wait, can I actually attack it? I think I can't. Oh my god. Oh my god. Ouch! Oh no, I think I just need to evade it. Ah! Oh my god, am I gonna die already? 
Thank you, thank you, Gloria, for the link. Wait a second. So that means I need to kill all creatures. I think only the green ones, right? And hopefully I won't be able to kill that eye-looking fella. Oh my god, I, I, I might just actually restart this. I, I kind of played very carelessly. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let me just die. Kill me. I'm ready to die. Okay, let's actually play for real. Oh. Yeah, let's, let's start from the beginning. That That's a better, a better way to actually play the game. Oh, and there's a chest here. I'm just realizing that. Oh, can I go around? Oh, heck yeah! Oh, the dash! Oh my god, thank you. Ay, ripollo, I know. <laughs> Sad moment, but hey, it's okay. We got this. I was playing a bit too confident the first try, so this will be different. This will definitely be different. And then we have our... Oh no, we don't have our dash here, never mind. Oh, heck yeah, much better. Oof. I'm here, fella. Oh, okay. That wasn't that bad. So far, so good. Oh, he kind of got stuck there, which that's going to be a bit tricky, but it's okay. Oof. Oh no, did it stay stuck there? Oof. Now that's gonna be hard. Oh, there you go. Oof. We did it, team! Okay, much better that, that that round. Ooh, and now this is getting tricky with fire? Excuse me. A heart. Perfect. Amazing. We got this, team. We can do this. Oof, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay, we're gonna need to find a red switch. <laughs> fuego, fuego, exactly, Sol. No, that's right. That's exactly it. Fuego means fire. Fancy. Let's check the right. Hi, Whisk. Welcome, welcome. Hola, hola. Bienvenido. Hope you're having a good day yourself. How's it going? We are playing Super Dungeon um, Maker. Thanks to the Indie Game Collective. We'll actually do a quick shout out to the IGC. Oh, we actually have a lot of friends in chat that are also part of this wonderful group. So people like Sol and Ale, i.e. Pichica Monster in chat. And Kat as well. Yeah, we have a lot of friends from the IGC. So definitely check everyone else out from the IGC if uh, you are into indie games. Um, but yeah, Whisk, let me know if you want to be called differently. I'm happy to do so. What is this for? Oh, there. Oh, no. Oh. No, I think we need a special ability. Um, to actually open one of these oh whisk uh, me gustaría que jugaras uno de mis niveles oh do you play this game uh, and actually well yeah I should actually be more clear with my rules on whether Spanish or English are allowed um, because so I'm originally from Mexico so I do know Spanish but I do know the community is, is heavily you know 
everyone knows English, but not everyone knows Spanish. Um, but yeah, definitely, if I have the time, Whisk, I'm, I'm happy to play one of your levels. Si, si tengo el tiempo, Whisk, uh, no hay problema. Pero solo si tengo tiempo, porque si quiero ver un poco más el nivel en general. So yeah, I'm pretty much saying that, like, I'm happy to check out a Whisk's level. I just want to at least finish the dungeon and check more of what comes in the game itself. Pero sí, Whisk, sí, sí tengo tiempo con mucho gusto. Um, ¿Cómo se llama tu nivel? Yeah, what's the name of, of your level? Oh, so yeah, I bet that the way you uh, interact with the fire, there's going to be a way to actually make, have these little, like, green boxes things on fire. Okay, I think, thank you for switching on uh, in English. But yeah, welcome, bienvenido. Ooh, I have a few dungeons, but search for wet escort. Ooh, I'll definitely uh, actually save that. But yeah, no, I, I love to check it out. But again, if, if I have the time, I might not have the time. But but if I do, yeah, why not? We're, we're kind of just kind of checking out the the game and exploring and I don't really have rules around that and I don't mind so heck yeah ah <sighs> this dumb thing oh my god <laughs> I love that I tried to kill it but it just didn't work oh I got a key awesome oh and a heart thank you Oh, okay, we got this team. So we have a key. Uh, I can't remember where we saw a door because okay, so not here, right? Because here we pretty much need that. Like yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> hey, <cat. laughs> welcome, welcome, cat. Oh, there it is. I found it. Here. Ouch! Oh my god, a spider? No thanks. Come on. Ah, some hearts. Maybe some over here. Perfect. Ah, thank you, Ale, for the host. I appreciate you for that. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, actually, for those that want to support the uh, stream, you can always host the channel. It's a free and easy way to support the stream if, if you if you want to do so. Uh, uh, Cap says, so I'm finalizing building plan layouts for Heather's Minecraft server launch tomorrow. Oh, that's really exciting, Cap. Yeah, again, I feel like... No, no, no. No, it's not tomorrow. It's... Wait, is it tomorrow? No, I thought it was in a week from tomorrow, right? Like, May 10th? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's May 10th. And I think May 10th is a week from tomorrow. Yeah. Yeah, I think so, Cap, actually. I'm like, wait. <laughs> because I'm, I might actually be busy. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The 10th. Okay, okay. <laughs> I'm like, wait. Did, did I forget something? Because, yeah, pretty much... Um... Skelly is busy this week. I, I think that's kind of why, why we ended up the way we ended up right now. Ah, uh, but it, it's so exciting, Cap, that you already have like stuff planned out for it and everything. That that's awesome. Again, I feel like I won't be able to plan as much as I'm very new to Minecraft, but I'm, I'm very excited that, that you're really putting so much so much into it, Cap. Yeah, I'm very excited for that server overall once it actually goes in effect. So heck yeah. And yeah, for those who don't know and are new to the community, Heather is a wonderful friend of ours, which both Cap and I are a mod of. Um, and her name on Twitch is Red Pandemon. Let me do a quick shout out. And she was the one who did all the emotes of the channel. So we were really good friends with, with Heather. <laughs> She's currently on a hi uh, hiatus. Hiatus. She's currently taking a break <laughs> from streaming, but uh, definitely check out her her art, her channel. You know, you can still see her bots. And yeah, she's great. 
pretty much. In summary, she's great. <laughs> oh, I'll be available to help you out in your Minecraft journey. Oh, that makes me so happy, Cap. Thank you, thank you for the help. Well, oh. Oh, I'm gonna head out and do some laundry. Yeah, no, no worries. Um, uh, Cat, all good. Thank you so much again for the raid. Uh, have a great rest of your day yourself or else. And and yeah, again, have yeah, just just have a great rest of your day or else. <laughs> hmm. Oh, perfect. Now we can go through this door. <gasps> oh, okay. Oh, a shield. Thank God. <laughs> oh my God, this little fellas. Oof. Oh, the shield is perfect for this. Oh, I'm just gonna attack. Attack violently. Oh. I think I must fall, apparently. Exactly. Have a good day. Or else. <laughs> exactly. Uh, Whisk says, I see you are in the tutorial. Yeah, no, I'm very, very new to the game, uh, Whisk. <laughs> uh, so yeah, I'm, I'm in the tutorial. I think I'm like in the third section of the tutorial. Oh, okay, never mind. Um, so yeah, I actually just started playing it today uh, through the Indie Game Collective. Uh, I'm assuming you're past the tutorial, uh, Whisk. Oh my god, I'm gonna die here. Excuse me? <gasps> what? Okay, so that means that I had to kill all the... Oh my god, I have to kill all the enemies in the previous dungeons? I'm not gonna be able to do that. Hey, with my shield. Shield time. <gasps> oh yeah, it opened. Oh my god. Oh, the bomb, thank god. Wait, can I use it here? Uh oh. <laughs> I'm gonna die with my own bomb. Oh, amazing. Oh, I, ha I have a few dungeons. Been playing since uh, price release. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, feel free to share like your name or the name of the your dungeon. I know. Um, actually, I should probably have saved their their name as well. Oh no, no, that's you, Whisk. I'm so sorry. I thought I got confused. Wait, we had we had another friend who was also playing. Oh, okay, yeah, Fred. I'm so sorry. I got confused. I I'm so sorry about that. So Fred was uh, here in chat before. Um, and Fred. Also seems to be very familiarized with the game. And then, yeah, same as you, Whisk. But yeah, again, for me, this is the first time. So yeah, Fred was the one who was telling me about how um, they add, like, different bosses and whatnot so far every week. And that there's some small updates going on here and there. Um... Oh, you know Fred? <laughs> Do you know Fred, Whisk? Uh... Oh, that's awesome. Oh, I, I, one of the things I actually love about playing indie games is that, like, people who are very passionate about the game, like, so, do show up in my streams. Ah, from Discord. I, I love that. Yeah, Fred was here. Fred was here a while ago. <laughs> um, so, I, I love that. Ah, but yeah, I'll definitely, if I don't get to check them out uh, in stream today, Whisk, I'll definitely check them out offline, as I, I do kind of want to try out other games and what better than check out the game that someone that stops by to say hi so definitely <laughs> i'm very close to dying right now so as you can see i really need a tutorial before playing one of your levels <laughs> um so that's kind of where we are right now <laughs> oh he streams this game every uh, tuesday oh i didn't know fred streamed i need to check that out has fred played uh your um your dungeons, Whisk? And let me know if you want to be called something else, Whisk. I just picked the, the first few letters of your username. Oh, yeah, the 
That's awesome. Right now I'm pretty much just looking for hearts. Oh, he's playing my newest one tomorrow. Oh, that's amazing. Oh, I love that. I mean, again, I love that, like, especially right within communities that they're really passionate about a specific game, you can really get to know people. Because I know for me, uh, I just stream a lot of indie games in general, so I probably won't stream this game again. But it's always nice to kind of meet other people who are really into a game so that if I later get really into the game, <laughs> I might see some of you, you know, you that, that join in, in other streams. Actually, can I just do this? Just gonna keep the space cold. The space. Oh, oh like... Also, oh, also attack while holding a shield? Oh, that's amazing. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Always. Oof. Oops. Maybe not quite literal. But hey, it's okay. <laughs> we'll start. I mean, and the nice thing is that I don't fully start again. Um, and this is going to this is gonna help me remember some locations in in this place like i don't need to redo all of these areas and whatnot but yeah i mean that tutorial whisk as you can see <laughs> so definitely still learning um but thank you for stopping by by the way i appreciate uh, that uh okay so let me remember so up here, oh, but now we have the bomb. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Actually, it was even better that I died because I feel like we will be able to, oh, there's nothing here, okay. We might be able to now actually go to this area faster. Oh, I heard uh, Fred say someone was streaming, so I came here, oh, I appreciate that, oh, Fred. Oh, I love that. Yeah, and again, I love that, like, you know, this is just like, Someone streaming the game for the first time, but even within your community, it's like, oh, someone's playing the game we all love. I, I love that. That makes me very happy. But yeah, we were just talking in my chat before that, like games like this, in which you can create dungeons, like have so much replayability. Like you can just play whatever games people that are very passionate into the game or that really like that creative aspect of the game you know like like you like yourself whisk so heck yeah in other words heck yeah <laughs> uh, let's see ah, perfect oh and then we have a key amazing oh i know we're in this area oh now we can go through here heck yeah if you like it, you can play once a week. I'll stream it once a week. Yeah, no, unfortunately, I, I probably won't be able to as, as I do. I actually stream Mondays and Wednesdays, uh, 6 p.m. EST, and then usually till 9. So I might be playing for about 45 more minutes. Um, and the way like my streams usually go about is that I get keys from different publishers developers so i i almost always play like a new game every day just to kind of showcase it i kind of really do more like indie game showcases there are some exceptions if i'm doing like a big charity stream like last charity stream i played you know celeste one of my favorite games so for that for that i didn't just play it during one stream but but yeah no i I might actually at least play it on my own more often, especially with all of the dungeon options, but but yeah. And this is definitely shield time. Uh oh. Let's go. Oh, uh, oops. Ouch! <gasps> oh, no, no! Oh, I need to go this way. Oh my god, I think I'm just gonna run for it. Boom. 
What's that? Oh, this is a new item. Oh my god, I love it. <laughs> and it had little chicken around. And the chicken was like, oh, I love that. Um, oh my god, that's really creative. I, that's really wholesome. I love that. Okay, great. We have hearts. And here is the switch we needed. Amazing. That's pretty much... Oh, no, 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 no. Oops. Now, if we fall, are we gonna go to a new level? We didn't. Okay. Yeah, because I don't think my... Oh, I don't even have the... The shift option. Oh, use the hook. Thank you, thank you. Up to the torch. Oh my god, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> you just saved me. Yeah, and, and I don't mind um like advice. I mean, I, I don't have like a no back seating or whatever, especially with especially small things like that. I appreciate. So yeah, thank you, thank you, Whisk. Oh my god, I would have like <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, what? thank you. <laughs> I don't know why I didn't think of that. Oh no 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 no. Oh yeah. Okay okay. This hook is amazing. Wait, can I, let's see, can I do this? And then, oh no, 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 but I won't be able to. Panda. You bombs. Oh, and the bombs. Thank you, Whisk. Ah, oh, and hey, Panda. Thank you for the 69 bits. <laughs> oh yeah, oh yeah, Panda. How are you doing? How How is everything going? I, I hope you're doing great. Oh, yeah, to Panda indeed. Ah, so, Whisk mentioned about the bombs. Yeah, let me actually practice this. Okay, so that's the bomb. But then I think I can throw a bomb. Oh, what if I do and then R? No, okay. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oops. No, okay. But yeah, I, I do have that bomb option. I was coming by for a sec to say hi. I appreciate you, Panda. I have been lurking and feeding the cub. Yeah, I know Tanuki was telling us about that. Um, You do? Yeah, yeah, feel, feel free to share a whisk. Any, any advice on on how to better use the tools? Feel free to share a whisk. Uh, thank you for the help. Hi, but yes, Panda. I hope the cub is doing great. Or else. You do same as pots. Oh, <gasps> that's right. Thank you. Thank you. Oh my god. Okay, I need to practice that. But thank you. Okay, no, I need to be better at that. Okay, so let's see. Let's practice. Let's practice this team. So I'm gonna put Q, then E, and then E. Oh, okay, we 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 got we got this. Oh, oops, I did it too quick. Q, then E, then E. And then one more time. Q, then E, and then E. And now we kill that. Heck yeah, thank you so much, Whisk, for the, for the advice. Panda says, well, sort of, more like redistributing. <laughs> yeah, that makes sense. That, that, that makes sense, though. <laughs> so, so all good, Panda. Oh, wait. Oh my god, I am... I need to remember. Yeah, I, I wasn't able to go to this before. Oh, and then I can... A key! Heck yeah! And then with the bomb ability... And now that I know that I can throw them... Oops. Heck yeah! Okay, I'm gonna try to do the bomb ability again. Oh heck yeah! Oh, that's so satisfying. I'm like, I like killing these, these um, spider thingies, but I do. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. 
Um, okay, so Q, then E. No, don't go away, spider. Oh my god. Oh, and then Panda says, uh, doing well. Got my new pajama pants. Uh, and Whittle Station's t shirt on. Sitting down in a second to have some tasty dinner Tanuki's mom made. Oh, enjoying life. Oh, I know that makes me so happy, Panda. Especially, I feel like. I don't know, I feel like, especially the very first like days of being a parent for the first time it's both like very exhausting very stressful but also like very rewarding and very exciting so i'm, I'm really happy to hear that like positive side of things for now panda that, that makes me really really happy yeah how's fatherhood feeling yeah definitely how how is that going ouch i'm gonna kill that i'm gonna kill that bean and now we have a key, heck yeah. So we got this team. Oh, and now that, oh. Okay, 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 okay. We got this. I think it's this way, right? Didn't we need a key over here? Oh, no, 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 this is this part that now we were able to get because of the hook. Ah, okay, 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 okay. So up, connect there okay okay then ha 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 okay 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 oh wait i think i needed to go oops hi oh, fantastic and amazing heck yeah indeed oh, okay oh, okay i am Wait, what was this thing again? Let me try it again, why not? Let's be chaotic again. Okay, okay, so yeah. I get it now. <laughs> the was was really silly. Actually, let me see if there's any... Oh my god. Oh, some of them I actually need. Like that one, for example, I do need to carry it. I bet it's this way. What was in here before? I can't even remember. Certainly earning my dad joke license, but very much <laughs> worth it. <laughs> That's cool. Um, oh, Whisk, you need to go back at the beginning to use the hook. Oh, okay. Thank you. Thank you, Whisk. Yeah, yeah. With things like that, do, like, yeah, feel free to, to help. I feel like the way you help me has been really great. Like, not over helping, but. Oh, baby. <laughs> I feel like my strategy is to die so I can be in the beginning, but I feel like that's too cheap. Wait, is this the beginning? Panmoli! <laughs> wow, Panmoli is quite... It's quite the... The praise, um, Panda. Okay, no, 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 no. Yeah, this is the beginning. This is the beginning. And then to use the hook. Okay. Okay. Let's go. Before we die. <gasps> Although, I feel like we're gonna die real quick. Oh my god. Oh, is this what I need the hook for? I bet. <laughs> Panda, I feel like my strategy is to die. <laughs> Thank you for that. Oh, yeah. Okay. See, now I'm at the beginning, as a whisk suggested, so... Like this. Uh... So before this is the tutorial, so <gasps> wait, can I kill this now? No, never mind. Bye. I go around. Yeah, yeah, no, no worries, Panda. Uh, have a great rest of your day. And be epic or else. No. 
Yes, good night, good night, Panda. Uh, definitely try to rest as much as you as you can or else. Oh, it also serves as, as a shield. Wait, actually, let me try something. Now there was a room with a... Oh, there was a room with a hole and a torch. Yes. I think that one was north here. Oh! Thank you, Whisk. And I have the key. Oh, amazing. Thank you. Thank you, Whisk. <laughs> we will have stayed here for a while. Yes, exactly. Night Panda support the head. Heck yeah. We got this team. I think we're gonna go into a crazy area like this. We got this though. Okay, so. What we learned. We can throw bombs and also carry them and throw them away. Um, these can only be moved with my E ability. Then I have a sword. And I can hold on to the sword to do like a bigger attack. Um, what else? Then, oh, and I have uh, my little fella friend that I can hold onto torches. Okay, let's do this team. Uh, let's start. I immediately like panicked. I'm like, let's do this team! And then panicked! Oh my god. Oh my god. Come on. <laughs> I feel like Whisk being here, like, oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, I didn't mean to do that. I didn't mean to restart it. Oh my god. Oh no, 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 I didn't. I didn't. Eh, si se puede, si se puede. Thank you, thank you, Soul. Actually, and I, and I just realized that, like, carrying this specific base was the worst idea because that meant that this little fella was on the other side. So, okay, shield. <laughs> Whisk. <laughs> mm, exactly. <laughs> uh, okay, cool. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Yeah, let's go over this side, as we already killed. Oh my god. My brain today. <laughs> I'm getting killed. Okay. Okay, we got this. Okay, this is definitely a shield moment. Oh my god. Okay, we'll try again, team. <laughs> okay, third third time's a charm. Let's do this. Ooh, I feel like I should get better with my voice mod um, options, but we could do like... I feel like before, I was like... <gasps> oh no, something's gonna happen. But now... We have our magic sword, and we're gonna be able to succeed in this dungeon. That's pretty much what's happening right now. Okay. Ah, uh, hey, yay, yay! Hi, thank you, Whisk. Okay. So, first things first. Don't get killed. Second, you know, pretty straightforward. Just don't get killed. <laughs> uh, okay, now... Uh -huh. Heck yeah. Okay, so now we know the strats. We know that we should have opened this one instead. Oh yeah, and the and the spider fell is not there anymore. Okay, that's good. Heck yeah. Okay, okay, we're doing much better, team. Oh, and there's a fella over here. Oh, it's a little fly. Okay, amazing. 
Okay, now we just need to go to the other section. Oh my god. Anyhow. Uh, let's go. Oh, now we're gonna open this one. Come on, fella. Don't be shy. Are you serious? Oh, and I need to do this. That's right. Actually, I think I know what I'm gonna do. There you go. I'm gonna fight this first. Perfect. Okay, much better. I mean, I shouldn't have grabbed the heart. And now we are gonna kill. Oh, actually, I'm gonna do this. Wait. Oh, heck yeah! Oh, heck yeah, we got this team! Oh, we're so close. What are we missing? Oh, is there a fly here? Oh, we're really close to the end of, of this area! Oh, that fly. That's what we're missing, aren't we? Yeah, that's what we're missing. We did it, team! We did it! Oh my god, that was harder than I realized. I, I feel like... Yeah, I feel like I might need to try more um, tutorials before I check out one of your levels. Um, well, Fred's levels. Wait, I, yeah. Did Fred share the new levels? No, I, I, th I think Fred was just stopping by. Oh, yes, thank you. Thank you for the stretch, Ali. Thank you, thank you. And the hydrate. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> yeah, let's go check one of your levels. Um, although, <laughs> I am very new, so they might be a bit difficult. But at, at least, you know, I, I'm happy to, to share them to the community. Um, let me check my Discord as I sent a reminder there. Wet escort. Yeah, let's at least check it out. Heck yeah. And actually, uh, regarding Ale using community stretch and community hydrate, it's not just me the one that needs to do the stretch and hydrate, but all of you. So definitely, if you haven't, make sure you get in your stretches and stay hydrated or else. Let's do this. Exit dungeon. Yeah, let's check out our uh, Whisk's game. Let's do it. So... Oh, there it is! Oh, I haven't actually... Ooh. Oh, okay. So, it's gonna be involved moving somewhere in that area. Oh. Oh, because it's like sand, so I can't be there for too long. I see how it is, right? Is, is, is that what's happening? Aha, uh -huh, this is this is the thing that we need to move. Quicksand. Yeah, exactly, exactly that, Ali. Thank you. <gasps> oh my god. Oof. But that's probably later in the game. Yeah, the quicksand. Ooh, the quicksand mechanic does make it difficult. Oh my god. I really like that, though. Ay, 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 ay. Oh, I get it. Oh my god, do you guys see what I'm seeing? <laughs> oh my god, this is so hard, but I love it! So, the way that works is that when I'm like pulling it, it kind of like disappears. Like, once it's not in its original spot, there might be some changes in the area. 
and it's exactly those changes that like you need pre pretty much need to take advantage of for how long you pull it. Ay, 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 ay. And then with the quicksand mechanic, it's even more tricky. What? What? Huh? Oh no. Coco, I appreciate you stopping by and lurking. I hope you're having a good day or else. I can't actually watch at the moment, but hope you're doing well. Yeah, no, no worries, Coco. Hope lovely time, everyone, to you as well, Coco. I hope you're having a great start of the week. And thank you so much for the lurk. I appreciate you. Okay, yeah, this is definitely for someone that is beyond the tutorials but i love i i I, lo I love how creative you are with it a whisk ah oh, see the thing again like i first need to defeat these monsters <laughs> the, the quicksand is really exciting <laughs> oh i'm definitely once i finish the tutorial i'll try to to beat your your level for sure whisk and i'm more than happy to to yeah to try it out again because right now i mean i'm very close to dying I, I mean i'm gonna try to progress with within it as much as i can but no promises <laughs> no promises here oh, especially the quicksand is such a good yeah okay <laughs> okay that was fast <laughs> that was faster than i wished actually i want to try a little bit more wait Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. See, and I already... Oh, and then, yeah, like, the monsters do get killed. That's right. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. We got this. Oh. And then, and then what? Wait, and then what? Wait, what? 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 Red? Do I need to change it to red? Maybe? Wait. Oh, there's gonna be one. Oh, it's a triangle. It's okay to die. There's gonna be one of them that I can move. Hmm. Oh, that's a mechanic for advanced knowledge, but I can guide you. Oh, sure. Yeah, and exactly. Enjoy, enjoy your lurk, um, Coco. Oh, this looks hard, but you're doing great. Yeah, thank you, Ali. And again, Whisk, if you want to show me the, the mechanic, uh, feel free to do so. But if not, like... Again, I feel like the more tutorials I do, the easier it will be to actually play games like this. The blue and red are invisible in the same spot. The blue and red are invisible. In the same molly that is shown above. Oh yeah, so Whisk Molly is referencing uh, Fish Molly. Actually, can someone in chat... Actually, yeah, fish. Actually, I'll do it. Fish moly. There you go. And then we made our own version, which is axo moly. So that's that. Exactly. Thank you. Thank you. Um, okay. The blue and red are invisible. <laughs> thank you. Thank you, Ale. I appreciate you for doing that. Thank you. Thank you. Oh my god. I love it. Okay, so the blue and red are invisible in the same... Oh! I see exactly what you mean by that now. <laughs> Your face turned to Exomoly as well. Of course, we, we, we have to turn it as, as much as, as possible. <gasps> okay, okay, okay. 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 
How fast? Okay, now that you get it, you need to pull the thingy off. One at the Like the very beginning, you mean? Oh, this one? Or did I mess up? Is it that one? What have to do with this cactus? Oh, you need to die, okay. Wow, like if, even... Oh yeah, I can just die here. I'm just gonna die peacefully. Or maybe not that peacefully. Oh, that is also intentional. Oh, wow. See, dying can be a strat. <laughs> I know Cap was giving me a hard time. <laughs> no, I think Panda. Panda was the one that read a quote about dying. Oh, because I did checkpoints. Oh, that's... Actually, that's a really interesting way to like... Like, make the game in such a way that like you have to go to a previous checkpoint like purposefully that's really cool whisk oh here Wait, and then? Keep going. Keep going to the right, you mean? Yes, okay, awesome. One is the escort. The figurine, you mean? Maybe I didn't follow something. I feel like I might have missed it. Oh, okay, this one, got it. Oh, no, I need to restart, don't I? Oh, th there you go. Oh, oops. I forget that that happens. I had that one, awesome. Oof. Come on, come on. Oh, that's the escort. Got it. Oh my god. I'm <laughs> so bad at this. Let's do this. Let's do this, team. Ah, there you go. We got this. God, did I mess up with that? Ay, 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 ay. Okay, because I don't think I can move this anymore. Oh my God. Oof. Although I just kind of Oh no, I can swim? I know I can swim, I love that Oh my 
my god. Oh my god, this is so cool. Oof, am I gonna make it? I don't think so. Oopsies. But I I, I, I can still swim. Actually, yeah, let, let's, let's see if we can finish uh, this level before um, the end of stream. If everyone's okay with that. I, I kind of like that we're just playing like someone's level who's in chat. I absolutely love that. Um, okay, E. Let's do this. I, I'm definitely getting a hang of it. I feel like after doing this level, like all the uh, tutorials will be easier. You see the string is what that sets a timer. So the longer you play, the more time you have to get to the end. Oh. Oops. Oh my god, that's kind of insane. Well, let's, let's keep trying. I do want to see how far how far we get. I'm kind of excited about that. If you see, once you pull the thing, it will open that door. Yeah, like this door, right? This this, this door. The, oops, sorry. I can just do this. This door. Yeah, I did see that actually. If, if that's what you're referring to. So yeah, I, I totally get it. Like here, we can even see it from here actually. Yeah, there you go. Okay, yeah, let, let's let's try this team. I do want to try it. Can we make it? I think we might be able to. Oh, wait. Ay ay ay. And then Oh my god, am I gonna be able to make it? No. Okay, I don't yeah. Okay. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna it might be too impossible, but yeah, I, I think I, I see what you're saying that I can like then do this and then do that, but then that was a bit too late. Okay, let's keep it like this for now and then see if we can do it. Let's go. Oh my god. Oh, that's the hard part of the dungeon. Oh, that that specific combination thing, Magiga. Yeah, and I'm I'm gonna die. <laughs> and then there's probably a strategy of like where to go so that you don't get attacked. Oh my God, I love it, Whisk. Thank you so much for sharing it with the community. Thank you, thank you. Um, exit dungeon. Yeah, we're getting close to the end, actually. And then... Oh, that was the last part. Yeah, and then... Yeah, because it's pretty much like finishing that area to go through the door so that then... You can actually get the golden um, egg. Yeah, but that was fun, right? So I agree. That's a really cool dungeon whisk. Yeah, heck yeah. I can give you an easier one. Yeah, actually, uh, I, again, I won't be able to stream it, as I'll probably actually end um, now. We're 10 minutes um, close to 9, uh, which is usually when I end. But I, I will definitely be happy to check it out offline. And, yeah, and I did save it. Uh, actually, can I do something real quick? Yeah, little hearts. Oh, sure. Hey! <laughs> I love that. Oh, 
your, your little uh, icon. I love it. Perfect. Water challenge dungeon. Only water. Make them difficulty. Time-based escort level. Have fun with this challenge. Uh, yeah, thanks so much for sharing it, Whisk. I love it. Wait, I think I unhearted it. Give me a sec. Oh, no, no. I hearted it. Heck yeah. <laughs> oh, perfect. Whisk rim on search. Ah, I'll definitely add that on my notes. There you go. I added them. I, I just have like a note section on my Discord server. So that's that. Uh, let me see your messages. Okay, I'm going to exit this area. And I'll go to chatting. <sighs> so that was Super Dungeon Maker. We were able to see some of the tutorial sections of the game as well as just do the sandbox thing to at least get a glimpse of how much you can do creative wise in the game and then we were able to actually play a game um a dungeon made by someone in chat by whisk 